Hello champion, Sam, the red player, and it's given to David Plank when we pirates B map, guys. I immediately see that governor's graveyard and the whole combined is of one point hold. If a bother being either the outskirts or a farmer's bluff. Right, so means would be good to go for this, but it's very the poor player will be already going for it. Well, don't you blitz my four troops? Don't you be an idiot sandwich? Purple myself, I will probably be going for this guys, right? And he blitzes and just simply loses. You're an idiot sandwich, purple for troops by blue. Why didn't a poor player go for this one, guys? You could have taken over it immediately. Instead, he had to try blitzing my four troops. Let's see, right? the blue player will be going for the four guys. Let's say, okay, myself, I might be first of all, okay, well, that's a split, well, guys, I'd have to take over these territories. Well, here, be Kraken, guys, is a free territory holder, like to go for it, right? So, well, the black player will be going for this one, guys. That's a literal honey pot, right, well, guys, the purple player <laughs> wanted to go for this combined call, guys, and right there, black player wants to go for it, too, guys, but the black player is being much more smart about that, guys, he doesn't do dumb blitzes. Well, this also necessarily wasting these two troop armies, right, well, guys, okay, well, this one, two troop army. Trust me, okay, I could go for hex bounty, guys, even, but ultimately, this one is better, guys, would be plus seven troops if I end up calling it, so I'll just simply go for this one, let's go, and let's on turn, guys. Six troops by white. The white player got an easy choice at first, guys. Would be super surprised if he goes for another call, guys. And yes, he goes for a noob corner. For the noob corner, guys, on the map with these blizzards. Six troops by yellow. Would be hilarious if the yellow player decides to add his troops at first, guys. Absolutely insane. The yellow player could still, I guess, take over Hex Bounter at first, guys. The purple player didn't go for it. And myself, I had a better hold to go for. Right, plus three troops. But why only plus three troops, guys? Right, plus three troops on another place of the map. That's confusing. That's confusing, guys. Okay, well, I mean, I'm surprised I'm the only one getting a call, guys, in the beginning of the game, despite when other players had good chances as well. So, for example, neither purple nor yellow took over this, and neither white nor blue tried taking over this one. Alright, well, come on, you purple red, where were some personal vendetta against me? Right, where if you try breaking through me, but okay, few, you go right where. Four throws by blue. Right, so the white player would like to be an ally, so let's set his alliance request, guys. Let's actually send an alliance request to a black player, guys, because if a black player doesn't break through me, then I end up getting my ship's hold right where, guys, called here, be cracking. I mean, let's just send to make as many alliances right where as possible, why not? Even send an alliance request to the purple player, guys. The purple player right where is kind of unpredictable, guys will be a wild card in this game. Right, so the blue and yellow players. I set my alliance to quest, guys, and I already had an alliance with a white player, guys. And finally, the black player that sets my alliance too, guys. So basically, I'm not on a light with a purple player. Three throws by black, guys. Right, so the black player will have to fight it out with a white player, it seems now. Unless we suddenly become, decides to become friends, guys, but I think that's unlikely. Yeah, I think the white player is wiping out black if you waste your troops like that. The white player will have advantage to take over this hold now, it seems. 11 trust by me, guys, right where I'm already dominating the game, I'll double down on my advantage and just simply take over Libertalia right there, guys. Let's go. <laughs> Let's just simply attack right there like this, guys, I might get broken through my ship's hold, but that's fine. That is fine, guys, right where I'll just simply expanding to this one. Let's go and let's fortify like that. Nice. Three throws by that, guys. Alright, so far it seems like an easy W, guys. But we'll see. Maybe the situation changes. Right, so far I'm at 19 territories and 34 troops, guys. So far the strongest player in this game, but obviously the situation could, the situation could still change, guys. Especially if I get broken into my hold. But well, somebody could broke through Herbie Kraken, guys. I do not think anybody will break to Liberty Lear at first, guys. And so, right. Will the white player wipe out black, guys? Or what? Will he do? Let's see. I know you want to blitz a black player stress, but right where you do not. You might be waiting for the black player to finish taking over this hold completely. Right now, the yellow player should definitely finish taking over Hex Bounty, guys, but I think I'll be just simply wiping him out if he does. Right? We'll see. Hopefully, he fails his blitz, guys, or hopefully, if he takes over it, then the purple player breaks through him. And right, he'll be waiting. Three throws by purple. Let's see, right? So, the purple player is the only player I do not have a lance with, guys. And let's see if he tries breaking from here, or what will he even do? Just simply still consider going right where purple would be the best for me, right? Well, right? I mean, if he quits the game, guys, then well, that's good. Good for me, right? Well, myself, I'm going to expand to least. Landing right where nice guys. Right into purple players of line. Five throws by blue. Right where let's make 
I challenge guys let's not let anyone to have any part in this game. So if somebody gets a call guys in this case of a blue player does, I'll just simply break with him. Let's see, can I prevent either all of the players guys from getting any bonuses? I mean not getting them but actually calling them right there. The blue player already took over the soul guys but can I just simply prevent all of the players from having holding either of these? Let's see right but I mean right there it might depend on the white player guys. Should we still go with the challenge? Let's actually add more troops at there, guys. I mean, we still at there are connecting, right? Well, I hope so. Let's add more troops right there too, guys. And I want to expand to this one. Right, so let's break the blue player, guys. Let's break the black player too, guys. Yes, you know, black white's incoming right there. And right there, I'm going to take over these extra territories right there, guys. To take over this world. Right, so blue player breaks alliance, right? Let's go and let's fortify more troops like this, guys. Nice. Three troops by white. Yeah, I guess I sh couldn't have this, guys. The black player action ending up calling governor's graveyard. It right there, it gives you plus 10 trust, guys. The white player might have allowed him calling, right? So let's see, will he help out black guys? Will he blitz my four troops? So far, no, he doesn't. Right, three troops by yellow, guys. Maybe the white player fought, but these two territories are connecting each other, but we aren't. Right, so the yellow player will take over this, guys, but... I'll make sure to break through him as well, guys. I'll make sure to break through every each of the players I can. At the very least, I'll try my best. Three troops by purple. The purple players about, guys, should have fortified more troops to Neptune's plunder at where, guys, instead of might get Iceland. Island. Let's see if these players could have set that three cards. Let's see if we do. So, for example, the blue player. Right, so far not. I mean, he'll be let's be six, these three troops, guys, which is completely fine, right? Well, they're pretty meaningless to me. Four troops by black. So, he will, he'll try to retake over this, guys, instead of wiping, instead of breaking me through right there, through Neptune plunders, guys. And so, he will don't you leave this territory right there. That's a big mistake, sir. So, when he throws by me, we'll make sure to break through him right there, guys. And I'll make sure to wipe out the yellow player completely. From this place, let's go. Okay, well, let's actually split some troops. Let's go. And let's wipe out a black player from right there like this, guys. Nice. Let's fortify more troops right there. Right, so I mean, so far I'm achieving my goal, guys. My challenge, I make sure to break through every each of these players, whichever ends up taking over anything. <laughs> right, where I'm totally owning them, guys, with this spawn right there. <laughs> right, well, the white player bite me out. He should, guys. He should, he should help out. The black player, I think. The black player not necessarily will have a set of cards, guys. And right where one of them should have wiped me out right from this place, guys. Because I'm going to add more troops to this place now. Right, yellow, let's see what can you do. You can attack some territories of mine, but that will basically be it. Not much you'll be able to achieve. Right. Right on you. I still got this territory left, guys, behind him. Three throws by purple. Still applying. Four throws by blue, guys. Right. Finally, the purple player goes MIA. Takes the last available place, in which case this is the sixth place. Which is totally decent because he just simply bought it out. So right for the blue player doesn't even have a set, guys, or doesn't trade it in. Right, capturing a bunch of territories, guys. I think I'll be going after the blue player at where. He saw Nasser at where the black player actually takes down my free throw partner, guys. Let's see if he's able to achieve it, guys. At where would be 10 troops for the black player himself and 11 troops for the white player, guys, if we actually can end up calling these. Right, so let's see what will the black player decide to do, guys, at where. Actually, I think I should have made a bigger army at where, guys, to prevent these players from retaking over it or having to waste a lot of troops. Actually, that would be a pretty strong position to have as well, guys, if I by part black and white at once right there. Would be really interesting. But at the same time, we should be careful right there about the blue player, guys. I think a blue player will look forward to attack me, guys, and the black player is offline. 32 troops by me. Let's add more troops right there, guys. Let's add more troops over there like this. Let's go. And so I want to be capturing territories over there like this, guys. And especially a bunch of territories of a blue player, guys, because the blue player has been aggressively, the most aggressively attacking me. Let's go. Let's wipe him out from over there, guys. And let's take some of our additional territories at there, guys. Honestly, I can take over some additional territories over there too, guys. Doesn't matter. Let's go. Let's go. Nice, nice, nice. Let's start the farm with Andrew Parmer at there, guys. Three throws by white. I'm absolutely crushing. I'm absolutely dominating this game, guys. Right, the white player just simply flags the game, guys. At first, he went to add some more throws, but decided to immediately flag. Right, the yellow player doesn't even have a set at there, guys. 
right? <laughs> goes out there with territories. It's already over. Yellow don't even try anymore. Free throws by blue. Blue player will trade. Now, said guys, let's see maybe the blue player is able to break from me. He'd have to add more troops. Right where, I guess. Oh, right where, okay. Even right where, yes. Even a better place right where, guys. But also, he'll have to blitz free troops of black. He perfect blitz. Even a perfect blitz, guys. Let's see what he is breaking through. Only one of the cards, guys. And that's it. Yes. Three throws by black. 37 throws by me, guys. I'm forced to trade my set. Let's put more troops right there. Let's put more troops right there, too, guys. More troops over there, like this. Right, so the blue player gives up, guys. Let's put more troops right there, too. Right. Let's attack these territories over there, guys. Let's go wiping out these territories from over there, too. Right, so the blue player is toast. I eliminate him from the game, guys. Three cards. Let's trade no sense. Let's add more throws at where, guys. Let's blitz black. Let's continue attacking the territories of the yellow player like this. The yellow player gets eliminated from the game, too. Alright, five extra cards, guys. Let's go. Alright, well, let's keep a wild card. Let's continue going over there, guys. Let's blitz black. Let's go, right, well, I'll just simply go for the wild domination victory, guys, let's go. Right, well, I fail with blitz, guys, we'll, we'll count to wait for another turn. Eight mantras by me, I'm forced to trade no set. Right, let's go, right, well, guys. Right, well, I only count to eliminate black and I've been in the game, guys, but let's just simply finish wiping out the rest of the players. Right, let's eliminate white. The last territory of the map, guys. We deploy these troops, and that's a GG. The spawn was absolutely insane, absolutely ridiculous, guys. Intermediate, intermediate, beginner, intermediate, and beginner.